Good morning everybody and welcome to another Rice at Lolo Railway video. As you can see, our brand new platform is more or less finished. Uh, we're standing at the hastel end of the platform. Apologies for any wind noise you can hear because it's been a bit stormy and windy this morning. But uh, yeah, I think you'll all agree, it looks lovely. Um, this is the sort of non-passenger end. This crossing here was just for us really to move stuff across if we want to. Um, but yeah, I think you'll all agree, it looks fantastic. They've done a nice job. And we'll have a quick wander down and see what else they've done. And I'll uh, take you through the other sort of finishing jobs that we've got to do now uh, that the main construction work has done. Uh, as you can see, there's a little bit of fence in there to do. And that's going to be sorted out in the next uh, few weeks. But uh, yeah, let's go and have a look and uh, see what else needs to be done. So now the um, contractors have finished, um, we've got to go along here where the, where the foundations and the concrete was that supports the platform. They dug a little bit out, but it's our job to reinstate the track and uh, get the ballast back. So we've got to dig out a little bit more of this uh, sort of loose concrete stuff and put ballast all the way down this side up to the platform edge to make it look nice. Probably do a bit of track alignment, um, minor adjustments and things like that. Um, and this, this is for the, what is now going to be the platform two uh, side of the track. And that'll stop the track moving uh, as trains running out of the uh, new platform. Where they've uh, left the services coming out of the ground just there by the corner of the um, uh, platform, uh, we're going to uh, put a manhole box in and then a trench across the track, or what will be the track, over to the far side um, on the bank there where those rails are lying. Another manhole probably for future use to take power and water up towards the points where uh, Graham Alexander is currently sitting. Um, we're not going to do the whole lot in one go, but we, the priority is because we want to get put track back along here by the side of the other platform. Uh, we'll put the trench across with the services and then leave it to finish off down the far side uh, at a late date, just so we can then start preparing the uh, track bed and start laying track around the other side of the platform. I'm now standing on the um, track bed of what was the third line. A uh, bit of tidying up to do here. We've got to scrape back the track bed again, back to um, base material, uh, filling down the side here with a bit more stone uh, that was left from before. Uh, put some bottom layer ballast near enough to the right height, and then we can start putting sleepers and rails on, ready for the track around this side. And if I pan round, it will join up with the track uh, that we were just looking at. So that's going to be our priority for the next sort of couple of weeks, maybe next month or so. Um, once we've done the middle line and cleared that out, we can start uh, running trains round again. At the moment, we've been using engine on both ends because we can only use the platform track. But uh, better get back to some more normal running and then it'll leave us alone just to fill in this third track and, and, and sort that out ready for uh, fully reopening. And uh, we'll hopefully get all that done before Christmas. So the platform surface has all been done. See the nice tactile paving along each edge. Um, the light fitting still needs to be put on top of the bollards and wired in, and that'd be for our uh, electrical officer to do. So there's a number of those to do, and uh, they'll be done in due course. Um, and once once that's done, we'll be able to help us mainly during Christmas when we when we run a Santa service, um, and it will light up this platform nicely with low level lighting. So we're now at the turntable end. This is the, this end's a bit more of a mess. Um, there's all this uh, junk on the top of the ground here. Uh, we've got to remove and probably use to fill in that hole. You can just see with the water pipe coming out in the distance by the manhole box. Uh, the guys are over here today with drilling sleepers for the, for the third track. So we've got to tidy it all up, level it all off. Um, put the fresh ballast down, ready for the 
third line to come through the platform off the turntable, uh, remove the plant crossing and replace some sleepers underneath there where the yellow peril's sitting and tidy up this end. But the crossing all looks good. They've um, gone round and regraded the crossing there by the gateway. And this will be the passenger end that people will be able to cross and use the other platform. Uh, so they've done a very nice job there and uh, we're quite pleased. So there's a bit of fencing to do. Uh, I think there's going to be another lighting bollard in the middle there, uh, just off the end of the platform and in the middle of the track there to light up the walkway. Um, but essentially that's it, they've done a good job and uh, it's just tidying up and, and finishing off now. Like I say, next few weeks, uh, no November into sort of like early December with a hope to have it done ready for the Santas. Uh, in December so that's all for now and uh, hope you enjoyed watching these videos and I'll probably do another couple as we progress with the track work.